Well, it's a busy weekend on 6th Street, whether you love art, music, or just you love food. You know, there are all reasons that crowds made their way downtown for the biannual Pecan Street Festival, one of the biggest and longest running festivals of its kind. Katie's Kayla Norwood gives us a closer look. Live music has a way of bringing people together. It's also a huge part of Austin's culture. There's a lot of music. Live music was amazing. So it's only fair that in celebrating the history of 6th Street, that music plays a big part. Those from near and far came together Sunday for the final day of the Pecan Street Festival. This is my favorite festival of the year. I never miss it. I come twice a year. I've been coming since the 80s. <laughs> yes, it's been a lot of fun. And it's nice to see it grow. It highlights many things Austinites love, music, food, and local art. I love it because everybody looks up and says, oh, you're from Austin. And you know, that makes them happy. And then I meet people from all over that are visiting. Terry Makashan says she's been selling jewelry at the Pecan Street Festival since 2005. And she now has customers from all across Central Texas. For those who attend the festival, this is also a way to find handmade items you couldn't find anywhere else. I got my brother is a Bama nut, and so I got him a Bama pencil holder. <laughs> and for Austin natives, it's an opportunity to come full circle and play on a stage they've only seen from afar. It's amazing to be a part of something that you, you know, go to when you're a kid and all that, and you're kind of like, oh, I want to be on a stage one day, and then you get the chance. It's, it's a very fulfilling feeling. A feeling you can get at one of the longest running arts and crafts festivals in the country. In downtown Austin, Kayla Norwood, KBU News.